So we're going to do some Thai marinated char grilled prawns. Okay, so here we're going to do them on little cocktail sticks, um, and we're going to I'm going to show you how to make a homemade sweet chili sauce, which is actually really simple. So here we've got some raw prawns, and I've marinated them in some soy sauce, and then I've chopped up really finely some spring onions, and I've used some of the very lazy chili, but you can use fresh chili if you want, and some coriander. So they've been marinating for a while. Oh, and the zest of a lime as well. Um, don't use the juice because the juice will, the acid in the juice will cook the prawns, okay? So that's your prawns and I have three on each little skewer, okay? Here I've got my char grill heating up, so that's on the go. And then for making your sweet chilli sauce, it's really simple. Because you've got a very lazy chilli in your fridge, um, it's actually really useful. So I've got here, it's about... Hmm, a really heaped tea tablespoon and then I've got two tablespoons of sugar okay now what we're going to use is um, you can use rice vinegar for this but I couldn't find rice vinegar so I've used mirin um, which is a sweetened rice wine vinegar okay so which that just means you don't need to use quite as much sugar um, and they're basically our ingredients with a pinch of salt so this is a saucepan here, I'll leave that one on the back. So get your heat onto that saucepan. And we're going to measure in about six, four, five, six tablespoons of mirin. And then you're just going to throw this straight in. Okay? And give it a really good stir. And you don't need that up on too high heat. Keep that on the medium heat. And what you want to do is, you want to dissolve the sugar and keep it bubbling until it gets nice and thick. Okay, so now you've got some smoke coming off your char grill pan. And all you're going to do with these is throw them on. And with prawns, it only takes about a minute each side because these are really quite tiny. So I'll show you what I did with the prawns. Basically, just got a little stick. And this is my prawn mixture in here with all my marinade. So you just get it and you pierce the tail like that. And then pierce it through the top end so that you gather it together like that. And then you just repeat that too. And three. So that's it. And you'll see all the nice bits of colour of green and red on that, okay? So they're your prawns. And you'll see them starting to turn pink very quickly. You can see all around the edges starting to turn this really nice hue of pink. Okay, so you can turn them over. Careful not to burn your fingers. Okay, so this is now coming to the boil. And basically what you want to do is dissolve the sugar and when the sugar dissolves in water it creates kind of thick syrupy texture. And that's what you're looking for in this. So, pinch of salt as well, so more than salt. And only a small bit, just to counteract the sweetness. And you'll see it's starting to bubble up. I hope you can see that through the steam. I'm not sure if you can. Don't spill it out. But it turns into all, it starts bubbling quite thickly on top. And that's when you know the sugar is starting to dissolve and it should go nice and syrupy. So that's it. It's really, really simple. And that's your prawns done. So with your prawns, you're kind of looking to get this nice kind of char grill colour on the outside. So they're ready. And that literally just takes about two minutes. Your chilli sauce is also ready. Then all you want to do is, so I've got a little plate like this, and I'm going to serve the prawn skewers, just all piled up. And these are really good for serving to a group of people, for sharing, all nice things like that. Um, get some coriander and pop that on top just to garnish it, and then I just have a little matching bowl. And what we're going to do here is just serve the sweet chilli sauce. And the difference in a homemade sweet chilli sauce and a bought one, it's not even possible to describe. 
So you're just going to have to make it and find out for yourself. But there you go. So simple. The marinade for that comes together really, really quickly. Um, and really good if you want it just for yourself, for selfish, or if you want to share it with people. Yep.